senior U.S. military airman and cyber analyst charged with money laundering for NFT rug pull scheme. Julia Smith last updated, February 27, 2024, 1526 ESD, two men read, two individuals, including a senior airman and cyber analyst in the U. S. Military have been charged for money laundering in connection to an NFT rug pull scheme, according to a February 23 statement from U.S. Immigrations and Customs Enforcement IC. Devin Allen wrote in A.K. Adeni or DeVince, 24, of Florida, and Berman Jerry Nolan Jr. A.K. A Repulse or Zayas, 20, of Alabama were indicted for money laundering and conspiracy to commit wire fraud following an investigation by Homeland Security. Over $300,000 stolen in NFT rug pull. According to the indictment, Rodin and Nolan convinced hundreds of victims to invest tens of thousands in cryptocurrency in a non-fungible token collection named Undead Tombstone. The duo failed to follow through on their victims' investments, instead stealing and ultimately laundering the funds. Beginning in March 2022, Rodin and Nolan opened a number of social media accounts to promote Undead Tombstone to the masses. The value increased significantly in the following weeks with the duo launching collections titled Undead Apes and Undead Lady Apes. The following month, the co-conspirators announced their collaboration on X with a well-known and successful NFT project. That same day, Rodin and Nolan abandoned Undead Tombstone before ultimately laundering and transferring the funds to cash. In a matter of weeks, the three NFT collections resulted in Rodin and Nolan receiving more than $300,000 in cryptocurrency from hundreds of victim investors all over the world, the indictment noted. A classic rug pull scheme in action. The scheme, known as a rug pull, occurs when a Founder or investor hypes up a product only to suddenly abandon it at its peak and disappear with the funds. Blockchain data firm Chainalysis reported that over $2.8 billion was lost to rug pull incidents in 2022 alone. In this case, Rodin and Nolan utilized a technique called chain hopping to obfuscate customer investments where funds are transferred between different cryptocurrencies in hopes of evading law enforcement. According to Elliptic, Cross-chain hopping reached a fever pitch in 2023 when the value of illicit crypto laundered through the technique reached an estimated $7 billion. Has Undead Apes been revived? On February 26, three days after IC's statement, an NFT collection entitled Undead Apes was released on Launchment, EO by a user named Aizjik R50 Savang. At the time of article publication, it's unclear whether the project is related to Rodin and Nolan and if it's also an NFT rug pull scheme. If convicted, both Rodin and Nolan face a maximum penalty of five years in federal prison. Follow us on Google News.